Welcome to Free Math. In this video, we have got these uh, two lines uh, AC and uh, AB that meet each other at this uh, point uh, A. And as a result, we get this uh, angle uh, X, as you can see in this uh, given diagram. And moreover, we got these uh, two parallel lines uh, BC and uh, DE, as you can see as well. And as a result, we get this uh, angle 143 degrees. And likewise, uh, this uh, angle is uh, 72 degrees. And now our task is uh, to find the value of this uh, angle X. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And in this video, I'm going to share with you with two different approaches. So therefore, please watch the video till the very end. And here's our very first method. And now let's recall the straight angle property and focus on this uh, whole uh, angle. This whole angle is going to be 180 degrees. And we know this uh, angle is 143 degrees. So therefore, uh, this uh, remaining angle is going to be 37 uh, degrees. And now let's recall the vertical angles property. And let's focus on this uh, angle uh, 72 degrees. Then this uh, angle is going to be a uh, vertical angle and that is going to be convert. If this angle is 72 degrees, uh, this angle has got to be 72 degrees as well. And now let's pretend that this uh, blue line DE does not exist. And we are going to focus uh, on this uh, triangle uh, ABC. And now let's recall the triangle sum theorem. According to this theorem, the sum of three interior angles in a triangle is always 180 degrees. So no wonder the sum of all these uh, three interior angles must be equal to 180 degrees. So therefore, I'm going to add all these three interior angles. So our angle is uh, X uh, plus angle uh, 37 degrees plus uh, 72 degrees must be equal to 180 degrees. Let's combine the like terms on the left hand side. So we got x uh, plus uh, 109 degrees uh, equals to 180 degrees. Let's subtract uh, 109 degrees uh, from both uh, sides uh, to isolate x. Uh, and here we can see they are gone. So therefore, uh, our angle uh, x uh, turns out to be equal to 71 uh, degrees. And now I'm going to show you the second method. And now let's recall the corresponding angles property. And we can see that this uh, angle uh, and this angle, uh, they are corresponding angles. If this angle is 37 degrees, this angle has got to be 37 degrees uh, as well. And likewise, uh, this angle and this angle are corresponding angles as well. If this angle is 72 degrees, uh, this angle has got to be 72 degrees as well. And now let's focus on this uh, tiny triangle uh, ADE. And now let's recall the triangle sum theorem once again. According to this theorem, uh, the sum of all uh, these uh, three interior angles in this triangle ADE must be equal to 180 degrees. So therefore, we can add up uh, all these angles, angle X uh, plus angle uh, 37 degrees plus angle 70 2 degrees equals to 180 degrees. And if we combine these uh, light terms, we are going to get uh, 109 degrees uh, on the left. And now we are going to subtract 109 degrees from both sides. This is gone. So therefore, uh, once again, our angle uh, X uh, turns out to be 71 degrees uh, as well. So thus in both scenarios, our angle X turns out to be 71 degrees. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.